Higher Self Message, November 27, 2015. Although there is no let up in the events on earth that are leading to the loss of life, what you are seeing is the outworking of karma that needs to be cleared. Soon the opportunity to do so will pass, and as the vibrations continue to rise, the negative energies will fade away. Already the changes are speeding up, and it is seen that there is hope for a more peaceful life. Those of you who proudly carry the light and do not engage with the dark ones are leading the march towards freedom. These are the times of great changes that will not be stopped, that will announce the coming of the new age. At many points upon the earth, the beginning of it is being laid down, so that once it commences it will quickly progress all over the earth. Be aware that there are powerful forces all around you, and when they come together there will be a sudden surge in positive activity. You will then know beyond any doubt that the new age is really underway and that there will be no going back to the old paradigm. For some time now you have been given indications of what type of changes is going to take place. There will be a swift advancement that will bring in welcome changes that will clearly indicate the direction you're going in. The old will disappear very quickly, as the changes advance you to a new level of life. In time the inequality that many experience now will be eradicated, and all will finally have a very acceptable level of life. Now is the time to access what you have achieved in your life, and whether you need to make some final changes. Some may find it difficult to do, but if you feel the least bit dissatisfied, then you clearly have some changes to make. Most of you are well advanced in clearing your karma, and whatever is left after the changes come, will receive dispensation. By now most of you should have cleared all of your karma except perhaps for minor matters that will certainly not hold you back. When you entered this lifetime you knew exactly what your plan was, and all through your life you have had immense help to fulfill it. Be assured that no one will have been given more than they could handle. As souls that are more aware than most, you can offer your advice where you believe it can help another soul. How far you go is dependent on what you feel that one will be able to understand and act upon. Clearly those who have advanced in their understanding are the most suitable ones to help others. As the vibrations are lifted up, many more souls will awaken to the truth, and spreading it will become much easier. Encouragement should be given so as to get others to seek the truth for themselves, as the new energies are opening people's minds to it. Where you see people engaged in negative activities, send them your love, and wish understanding for them so that they may be able to overcome them. Some souls are still unable to lift themselves up out of the lower vibrations, but there is always something to learn from any situation they find themselves in. Remember that each soul you encounter is either your brother or sister, and in essence no different to what you are. All are traveling a path back to the light, but simply at a different point along it, so no one is really better than another. Soon more advanced souls will come to the four who have incarnated especially to serve others at this most important time. The galactic forces are making sure the dark ones are held in check, so as to ensure that they are unable to interfere with the plan that will ensure your ascension. It only takes a few of them to cause mayhem. But now that the armed forces are taking a more positive role to ensure peace, their activities will be curtailed. The Dark Ones have penetrated all levels of humanity, but they are now being recognized for what they are. Once brought into the open, they cannot proceed as before when they hid behind others who carried out their orders. They will eventually be arrested and answer for their crimes against humanity. It may sound odd but we ask you to send them light so as to help them rise up again, but no one should wish to see another soul flounder as you are all one. It will be some time before the galactic forces can safely land on Earth, but that is their intention before very long. Then there shall be great celebrations to welcome the end of the rule of the Dark Ones. These events will take place in most of your lifetimes and are not many years away. As it draws near so you shall learn much more about them, although you already have some idea from what you have learned in recent times. As all of your changes are occurring, so Mother Earth will be making hers, and the ultimate aim is to return it to pristine condition. At such a time the lower vibrations will no longer be present, 
and duality will have long disappeared. As time passes you will do more work with the galactic forces, but still have the opportunity to follow your own desires. At such times you will entirely work for the light and be able to do so in absolute freedom from any interference. You will choose the nature of your work and with whom you wish to do it with, although there will be plenty of good advice available to you. You will have unbounded freedom with very few restraints. At present, some people still speak of having freedom, but it is only within the boundaries set by the Illuminati who have slowly introduced more and more restraints. That will of course change very soon, and gradually your freedom will be restored. Whatever level you find yourselves on, never forget that you are a being of love and light and it is your natural state. It is why you are encouraged to treat others with the respect and love you also desire from all of those around you. The giving of love freely without any expectation of love in return is how you will live your life. However, as you will be with other souls similar to your level, you will almost certainly receive as good as you have given. Your lives on earth will have given you the strength of character to face any tests with confidence. Be confident in whatever you do, and know that this cycle unlike earlier ones, will end with success and ascension for those who are already prepared. Some of you are uncertain as to whether you have achieved the required level of vibration to do so. If you have been positive and at all times tried to work within the light, you are certain to ascend. Ascension is not intentionally made hard to achieve, and how well you do is entirely up to you. However, with good intentions and living to your best understanding of what is required to live in the light, you will have done what is needed. The light quotient on earth is increasing all of the time, and as more souls draw it to themselves, it will continue to do so. Keep it coming and you will be helping humanity to rise up. I bless all souls wherever they are on the ladder of light. I am Mike Quincy and send all of you love and blessings. Tree of the Golden Light.com